Ashley. Hey, Ashley. Hey, how are you doing? Yes, we're coming to you live and in color from beautiful Antioch. Here we are. <laughs> and uh, we want to say hi to Ashley and Daisy and Rosie and Rosie. Bert, Bud. Bud? Buck. Buck? Okay. Bull? Bull? B Budsley? Bray Knuckle? I don't know. It's Brad. He knows oh, I'm Brad. Oh, okay. I can never get it I right. Thought, is there another I call dog? him everything but Braden. His name is Braden. It's Brad. So, uh, and also the the young son. He, his name is Braylon. Yeah. So yes. hi to you too, in case you're there. And if you're not, we love you too. What That's a right. what a aren't they great people? They are great people. They're great people. And they this are. morning, what I wanted to do for Ashley's birthday was to recall a few things about her childhood that she may or may not remember. One of the things, and, and you just react with everywhere you want to, just jump in if you want to. We used to play hide and seek. The girls and I used to play hide and seek. And Ashley and Molly, you know, Ashley was the older one and a lot, a lot more savvy. So it was hard to play hide and seek and Ashley not find me because there weren't that many places and we limited how far you could go. <laughs> so uh, uh, I would often go hide and then once I heard them uh, come out of the condo, I'd go back in the condo and sit down on the couch and wait for them. <laughs> to figure it out. Yeah. Or I'd go hide someplace that they'd already looked yeah. at. So yeah, the other thing I did was one time I hid in a tree and they're walking around underneath me and, and I'm going, click, click, making little noises. And, and they were going, I heard him. I just heard him. You know? <laughs> <laughs> that had to be hilarious. Oh man! And they and finally, I I said, I see you. And when I did, Ashley looked up. And she saw me up in the tree. And she said, Dad, no fair. You know, no fair. it's always no, no fair. fair. I was never playing by the rules. That's because my dad taught me how to play hide and seek, and he never played by the rules either. And uh, and of course, the other thing we would do, Ashley and I would play hide and seek with the dog, because Dexter, believe it or not, loved to play hide and seek. She would. Remember, Ashley, we would send her up to the top of the stairs, and then I'd go hide, or you'd go hide her, her ball, and then she would literally come running down, eager to go find it. And she, I used to think she used her eyes to find it, but no, no, she used her nose. She could smell her way right to her little toy. Oh, So those are a couple yeah. of little games we played uh, oh. when you were a wee little one. And as Indeed. you grew older, I think I was most proud of you, though, in the way you treated Trish because you've always accepted her, both of you, has accepted yes. her. Uh, she's not Ashley, she's not Ashley's mom, she's, she's, she's actually stepmom. That's right. Yes, and uh, Ashley uh, has always been very kind to you, hasn't yes. she? Yes. Uh, she sends you cards on Mother's Day. I know, I, I, I appreciate so that so much. We thank especially you. want to thank you for the way you treat my lovely Trish. And uh, uh, just, Thanks. So happy for where you are in life. So happy for your sweet little family. Uh, yeah. Ashley, I just you are an inspiration to, to to me and to and to Trish and to the whole family. You know, your yeah. prosperity and your kindness to others is really an example. And I want you to remember this fortieth birthday, yes, number four oh, <laughs> as a special, special moment in your life where you turn from building to using what you've learned and where you are to every day of your life helps someone else have an easier life. That's right. And that, that yeah. it doesn't matter what your religion is, that's a wonderful goal to have. So that's my gift to you and the sneakers <laughs> on your birthday. Do <laughs> yeah. you want to say anything to Trish? No, but life begins at 40, according to my mother, Rosie. And she's still doing it. She's 95. Five and they live together mom and daddy and do real well with it uh, we come over and help every now and then and you know that helps them a whole lot so, so don't forget this now when we get older and we can't do anything you need to move close to us and and take care of us right or, or no move us to, into your mansion <laughs> <laughs> By then she'll have a, a glorious manner, you know. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> okay. And I, I'm sure Brad is really liking to hear this. He's like, oh, yeah, we'll be glad to do that. And he's a good fix-it man <laughs> for a big house. Yes, he is. So we love you, and uh, happy, happy birthday. Happy birthday and many more.